way, I Elmhurst, I had very good connection with Elmhurst. when I was a graduate student in Berkeley, Elmhurst, um, I was actually a student of Max Born, but Max Born had a stroke. And then Elmhurst was called for, I think, for a year or half a year to, to give the courses. And Elmhurst is also from Vienna, and therefore it took care of me. And it was a great help. I think I owe Elmhurst more than I can say, especially the, you know, the way of explaining things simply, without mathematical complication, created mathematical complication. Now the story I wanted to tell is that Oppenheimer came to Elmhurst, to Leiden, he must have been in the late 20s or so. And, uh, and uh, uh, Elmhurst was a little unhappy about it. He wrote a letter to Pauli in which he said, uh, I feel a very intelligent and gifted American, but I don't know what to do with him because he speaks so fast and, and uh, I never really have under can understand what he says and he's arrogant, but he's a very good physicist. And then he said it would be good if he came to you, that you spank him, you must spank him intellectually into shape. And indeed, uh, Oppenheimer went about it. I don't know whether he was long enough to be spanked into shape, but the part is that for everybody who has worked with Pauli, he was Pauli's assistant. I remember the explore files myself. Well, uh, we were very happy to be spanked in the ship uh, and grateful to you for this. This is taped on June 17th during the visit of Professor Weisskopf to the Institute for Advanced Physics Studies in La Jolla, California.